my name is Robin. If you're new here, then welcome. And if you haven't already, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And also turn on your bell notification so you don't miss any of my new videos. Alright, so today I'm coming to you with a hair tutorial on how I do my flexi rod set on my natural hair. And I'm just going to give you a quick update on my natural hair. So, if you've been following my channel, you will know that I big chopped back in March. And I'm super happy with the length and the growth. So, I know it doesn't look like it's grown much, but it really has grown, y'all. Like, I will insert a picture of how it looked seven, eight months ago when I did the big chop. And I will insert a picture of how it looked yesterday when I blow dried it out. So, yeah, it's... It's a big difference, right? So, yeah, the shrinkage is real, and don't come for me. Like, my hair is getting there, okay? Okay, okay. So, <laughs> today I just want to do a flexi rod set just to give me a little length um, and some nice curls and just a style I can wear for a couple of days so I don't have to do my hair. So I'm just going to get right into this uh, flexi rod set. I'm going to be using this Shea Moisture Curl Enhancing Cream and this Lot of Body Foaming Mousse. So my hair is freshly washed and conditioned. So I'm going to start off by sectioning off my hair. Okay guys, I'm just going to be sectioning off my hair and parting it with my fingers. You can use a comb, but I don't really care about the part. So I'm going to use my moisturizer and use the mousse. And then I'm just going to start putting the hair onto the flexi rod. So at the end, you want it to be really flat onto the flexi rod. You don't want any hair to be sticking up. So this is probably the most important thing. And then you're just going to roll it and twist, roll it and twist. And that's pretty much it. And then close it off at the end, of course. So I did them two different ways. I prefer this way where I plait a little bit down like four times and then I put the flexi rod on and again just make sure the ends are flat down and you know no hair is sticking up you can use some more foam if that helps to lay it down all right and now I'm just gonna fast forward the rest it's pretty self-explanatory I'm really not twisting it any fancy way just twisting onto the rod hope y'all like it <laughs> 